Babe, I brought you donuts for breakfast. This is a protein bar. Yes, but it's donuts. I don't want a protein bar. Today's my cheat day. What is going on everybody, Eric the Electric come back to you guys again, my Electric Empire with another video. If you guys have been watching my recent food challenge videos, you guys will know I did a food challenge tour for charity in the northeastern part of the United States. Ended up raising a bunch of money for charity, I got some great footage, got to meet a ton of you guys, but more importantly, I got to film a very, very, very special video. For the last stop in the Electric Tour, I found myself in New York City, the Big Apple, where dreams come true, where everything happens, but more importantly, where all the food is. So for this video, everyone, I decided to eat everything I wanted for an entire day. That being said, I know you guys are fully used to me eating thousands upon thousands upon thousands of calories in pretty much every single video, but I wanna be very specific. I'm going to be doing that here, but this is not a calorie challenge. That being said, folks, there are no rules for this challenge. Nothing is off limits. Fast food, desserts, beverages, milkshakes, everything, you name it. If I want it, I get to consume it. This video is gonna be the second to last video from the electric tour. I had a great time, and believe it or not, everybody, the day after this video was filmed, I had a food challenge. Lots of food was consumed during this period of time, so I hope you guys really enjoyed this one. Without further ado, Electric Empire, let's get into it. It's time for the I ate everything I wanted for a day video. Let's do this. Alrighty guys, it is currently 10.06. Before I do everything, I gotta get a workout in. I don't have my bike while we're in New York, so I figured, you know what, let's just get a workout in. Let's get some weights, let's get some cardio in, and then it's time to feast. Alright everybody, so I have about a two hour workout, and then we're going to the first destination, to the place called the Pizza Barn. It's in Yonkers, New York, and they serve the world's largest slice of pizza. And then after that, honestly guys, I have no idea what the rest of the day has in store for us because it's gonna be a lot of food. But we're in New York. This is my second to last challenge before I leave, before I go back home. And today we're gonna be eating whatever I want. We gotta crush some cardio and then do some weights. And it's time to feast. All right guys, so post cardio, I make it an effort to get my compound lifts in. So I'm basically exercising my entire body, breaking down all those muscle fibers and then getting it ready for a lot of calories. Alrighty guys, so we got our workout out of the way. Now it's time to go to Pizza Barn in Yonkers, New York. Alrighty guys, so we are going to our first destination. They have massive super sliced pizzas and I do believe that there are gonna be some people coming out to watch. I had to get the appropriate shirt on for this. And uh, just so you guys know, we do not have our rental car. We're gonna be Ubering everywhere. So it might be a little interesting getting camera angles for you guys and setting up shots. Not at home in California, we're in New York City, everybody. Let's do this. All right, guys, we are here at Pizza Barn. It's time for our first meal. This is C-Snacks, this is my man Chris right What's here. What's up, yo? He knows how to do it. You guys gotta go subscribe to his channel. I, I appreciate that. Yo, yeah. he, he knows how to get his food on. I'll tell you right now. <laughs> nice to meet you, buddy. What's your name? Jose. Nice to meet you, Jose. How's it going? Go on, guys. What's up, Brian? Nice to meet you, Brian. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Trying to be like, Eric, do you love you? Oh, yeah. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. We're splitting you. We're splitting you. I gotta do it for you. I gotta do it for you. Subscribe to the channel. Oh, I love it. I love it. So, hand comparison. That's a pretty big, that's a pretty big slice right there, man. All right, guys, we gotta get our health and fitness for this challenge. They're making the pizza right now, and it's gonna come out, and we're gonna grub down. All righty, guys, so we're here. This is a massive, massive slice of pizza. 124 right there, everybody. Monday, August 19th, massive pizza time. I'm not sure, this feels like it's around four pounds, maybe actually even five or six pounds, but we'll, See how it goes. Where should I even start? Okay, I'll start with the fish. That's what she said. <laughs> I'm gonna time it for myself. I'm like, I'm like, I don't know if I want to enjoy this or try to go for time, but we'll see how it is. All right, everybody, ready to get this started in three, two, and one. Let's do this. 
or not. Really good. I'm gonna give this one a fire. That's that's sensational. Like that, everybody. Cause that, that's New York style pizza. One minute and 50 seconds in. Try it. Oh, follow that. I'm gonna breach it. Alright guys, this crust is almost as thick as me. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't beat the record, but seven minutes and 39 seconds here at Pizza Barn. I'm usually a fan of Chicago style pizza, but I gotta say, I'm I'm no longer just a fan of Chicago style pizza. New York style is amazing. Kudos to New York right now. If you guys are ever near Pizza Barn in Yonkers, New York, you guys get, definitely gotta come here. Just give a big shout out to all of you guys for coming and supporting me. Get on in here if you guys Woo! wanna come say hi. This is awesome, everybody. Everybody came out to support me. This is why I love coming out, doing tours, meeting all my fans. This is awesome. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. So, they hooked it up over here at Pizza Barn. We got an awesome shirt. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, so it's 2.05 right now. Still the same day. That pizza was absolutely delicious. I had a great time meeting all my subscribers, but we gotta keep the day rolling. Now we're about to go to a place called The Donut Plant. It's actually in downtown New York, so I got a lot of good stuff we're planning on getting today. So now it's time to get to the next destination. I want to wake up in a city that never sleeps. I'll leave that to Frank Sinatra. Alrighty guys, we're here at the donut plant. Let's get some donuts. Hi there, how are you? Good, how are uh, you? Good. Can I get one uh, vanilla bean donut, please? One uh, Valrona chocolate, chocolate donut, and then the chocolate chocolate donut. Uh huh. One PB and jam. Uh mm huh. -hmm. One PB and banana cream. Got it. One vanilla bean and jam. Mm -hmm. One cream brulee. One Manhattan cream, and then I'll get the black and white donut. Got it. The tres leches. The red velvet. Nope. You don't have them left. Oh dang no, it. No, we don't have any. Oh, you don't have any more. Yeah, had the mask Let's let's seven. do the coffee mm -hmm. cake then. And then I'll do the Brooklyn Blackout, please. Got it. I got like 40 minutes to leave. Oh, Can't wait man. To go home. That's gonna be me tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where are you coming yeah. from? Uh, San Diego. You want a bag or you gonna win? Oh, no, we're gonna eat them here. Like right now? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna watch them. <laughs> I bet you. Oh, but you gonna eat it by yourself? Yeah. If you eat all of this, man, I gotta, I'll give you a $2 bill. $2 bill? $2 bill if I eat all this. In one sitting. In one sitting? Four. I mean, four. Keep in mind, I just ate like five pounds of pizza, so. You gonna eat it here? Yeah. Yeah, I'm looking. If that's cool. Yeah, I'm yeah. And I'll follow you on freaking. Oh, yeah. Can you just look me up? Yeah. Just look up Eric the Electric. Yeah. I do Everything stuff. electric? Eric the Electric. All right, everybody, so we're here at the donut plant. What time is it, babe? It is 2 49. So, I'm gonna start with first. That's the question. Let's take square one first. Yeah. All right, everybody, let's. Do this. Don't taste like school lunch as a kid. I mean, that is, that is a thick donut. Alright, first one's down. What's this? Normal glazed. Fire. Vanilla bean. Oh, just kidding. Blackberry. All right, guys, so three donuts down. This is the Valerona chocolate donut now. 
That is a W. Oh. All right, now this is the vegan chocolate chocolate donut. Oh my gosh. Happy cake. Favorite so far. Well, actually, actually, I think probably have the favorite one right here. This is the creme brulee donut. Favorite. Peanut butter and banana. These are like 500 calorie donuts. Oh my goodness gracious. That one's my favorite. All right, guys, so last two donuts right here. Ooh. I'll take some more if you guys have any. <laughs> um, I have no idea what this one is, but. It's got stuff on the inside, it's good. I think I'm full. <laughs> two dollars, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. So I got, I got plays on all of you. Thank you. That's that's much. You guys gotta come to the donut plant. They're awesome here. Yeah. Alright guys, so a dozen down. Those were very, very dense donuts. Definitely would recommend coming here if you want to eat your donut plant. Total calories are gonna be like right there and macros like usual. Now it's time to get over to the next destination. And this is the awkward point of the video where Eric forgot to turn on his microphone. So we've included a helpful narration for you all. This is where Eric looks at his phone in frustration, then looks at the counter because no one is there to help him. He then orders one four-piece extra crispy fill-up box meal, and then says thank you, and please, 4,000 times. He then leaves and says it's time to go to the next destination. And this, my friends, is the second time Eric forgot to turn on his microphone. Pretty awkward, right? This is just Eric walking around aimlessly. He then orders one Shack Burger, one Smoke Shack Burger, one order of fries, one salted caramel shake, and of course a large lemonade. Alrighty guys, so we have our Shake Shack right here. I got some fries. We're not necessarily always about quantity. Sometimes you gotta go for quality. That's why I got some Shake Shack. I got a lemonade and I have a salted caramel shake right here. Because those of you that watch my Shake Shack Supercharged Mini Challenge, let me know that I forgot to get a shake. So here we are. 423, August 19th. Let's do this. Oh wow, not good. Thumbs up if you like fried chicken. Please team ketchup, comment down below. I am. Salt and caramel shake. That's good. I don't even know what this is, but it looks like a cheeseburger. The shake's down. <laughs> it was so nasty. I thought it didn't, I didn't know it came with peppers. I'm not being dramatic, everybody, I just can't do spice. Uh, it is. 4.38 right now. I'm gonna take a pass on the Smoke Shack Burger because I'm just repulsed by peppers right now. It's time to go to our next destination.
All right, everybody, I had to put the glasses on. We're at Levain Bakery. It's time to get some cookies. It smells good in here. Oh my God, it smells amazing. I might get one like, oatmeal raisin, and then one dark chocolate chip, and then one uh, dark chocolate chip peanut butter. All right, you guys, who is team cookie? Comment down below. Oh, yes. Oh, oh well. <laughs> Let's do this. Oh my goodness. Unreal. Wow. These are not small cookies either. Oh, the milk is awesome. It's really good to just do a cheat day where I just enjoy myself. Even though enjoying myself is usually like 15 to 20,000 calories, sometimes even 25,000 calories. These are a lot more fun than doing calorie challenges, admittedly. Wow. All right, so first cookies down. I think I'm gonna go after this one next. This is the oatmeal raisin. Ooh. Let's do it. Oh man, I'm gonna do it again. W, oh, W moment, wow. Here we go. Now we had to do it. All right, and this is the dark chocolate chip cookie. That's how it tastes. Okay, I'm not a huge dark chocolate fan, but I like it. Should've got more milk. All right guys, three massive cookies down and our milk. <sighs> total calories, we're gonna have those right there for you guys and also total macros are gonna be like right there for you all too. So far so good, it is 523 right now. I think it's time to go to our next destination. Our last stop, we are here at Carlos Bakery. If you guys watch Cake Boss, you'll know this place goes hard on the sweets and I like the sweets. Vincent, we're outside of Carlos Baker right now. I appreciate the support. What's your uh, favorite video? Oh man, the one, oh, anytime you do any of the sweets, when you just pile on your Krispy Kremes, oh, or, man. Yeah, I just love watching you eat like tons of sweets that I can. Awesome so dude, like, yeah, man, I appreciate the support. The East Coast hospitality is real around here, everybody. Buddy's the man. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and get a slice of the rainbow cake, please. Chocolate or vanilla? Oh, uh, we got choices. Yeah. Uh, let's, now let's do vanilla, please. Uh, what are these right here? These are cream cakes. We got hazelnut or vanilla. Let's do two and two, please. Let's go ahead and do two lobster tails, please. Your original? Yes. One chocolate cannoli, one normal cannoli. Let's go ahead and do a Napoleon. One chocolate eclair, okay. and one normal, and that's gonna be it. All right, so it is currently 7.30 right now. We just got home. Back. Right back in the hotel. I think I'm gonna veg out for about a half hour and then it's time for our last meal. Dessert, you mean? Yeah, it's time for dessert. When are you due? In the morning? Six weeks. <laughs> All right, everybody. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying the video so far. 7.58, August 19th. Whew, I gotta say, everybody, if you guys have made it this far in the video, go ahead and comment sweet down below. I gotta say guys, I've had a lot of fun today. We've gotten to eat at a lot of very famous places in New York City. Probably wasn't the best idea to start off with a giant sodium bomb pizza. If you guys have seen my, my challenges before, if you guys have seen my cheat days or my calorie challenges, I try to never really start with a giant sodium filled meal, but regardless, it was a great time. We got a jar of peanut butter right here. I had to go with some Skippy, I had to get some Ben & Jerry's. We went to Carlos Bakery right here, everybody. This is very famous. They have basically all the sweets, all the pastries, all the goodness. That was my phone. Not me. Yet. And then some rainbow cake right here. I thought I would end today with some sweetness. And uh, yeah, I have, a, I have a challenge tomorrow, so I'm not going too crazy.
do me a favor everybody if you've enjoyed the video so far go ahead and do me a favor and subscribe if you haven't already it helps support the channel and it lets me know that you guys want to see more of these and if you do want to see more of these be sure to comment down below because they are very fun to film and I have some ideas for videos like this that I want to do in the future and I do have to let you guys know that I am on a food tour I'm doing food challenges but I don't eat like this every single day trust me I eat very healthy outside of all of this and this is something I don't do very often so please don't think I do this every single day and don't think it's okay to do something like this every day. It is okay to enjoy life and to enjoy food and that is what I encourage all of you to do. That's what life is all about. Live it to the fullest. Now everyone it's time to get into our final meal here. This is dessert. Let's do this. Alrighty guys we have our health and fitness of course. It's actually really interesting how they actually don't have caffeine free diet Pepsi on the west coast but they have it here. Shout out to the east coast. There's nothing like a fresh jar of peanut butter. I don't even know how I'm going to use that peanut butter but we'll find a way. Here we go. Here's the chocolate chip cannoli. Let's do this. Boom. Oh man. Cream puff. That's good. I'll tell you guys right now, whenever I do these giant crazy days of eating, all I crave is a liquid, usually Gatorade, water, and Diet Pepsi. And Sprite Zero, I really like Sprite Zero too. And here is the peanut butter cup Ben and Jerry's. Oh yeah. So far, so good everybody. I gotta say the highlight of today was probably that pizza. It was awesome. And then those donuts. What you can do though, everybody. You're at that moment where you gotta innovate. Let's combine forces with peanut butter and a cannoli. We're gonna do it everybody. We are going to do it. Electric Empire, let's try it out. Oh man. W! Oh! Gabby moment! Oh. Alright guys, well, we have our Ben and Jerry still left, about a quarter of that left. Then we have this right here, which is like a, what is this called again, Dan? It's an eclair. Eclair. It's an eclair. Oh, it's got some fruit in it. We're getting our fruit in today, ladies and gentlemen. Let's try it out. Not bad. It's actually pretty refreshing. You knew I had to do it. You knew I had to do it. Now I feel the sugar rush really hitting me. <laughs> okay, now let's finish off our Ben & Jerry's. You guys gotta comment down below what your favorite Ben & Jerry's flavor is. For me, I like this flavor a lot. It's obviously why I picked it. I also like milk and cookies. Just pretty much anything that doesn't have fruit in it. Alright, our pint Ben & Jerry's is down. I think this is called a Napoleon. Now comment down below if you guys know why this is called a Napoleon. I have no idea, but we had this on our channel, The Electrics, and that's why I had to go back to Carlos Bakery because I know that they do it right, so let's do this. Oh man. Alright everybody, and these are the lobster tails right here. Ooh. Actually, no, we actually already had these on the electric, so let's see how they taste. I'm gonna give them another fire. There's been a lot of fires in this video. <laughs> Alright guys, well, we have one, two more things left. I also wanna say, that I just, I really appreciate you guys. Actually might be close to the million when you guys are seeing this. I might already actually be at a million. This actually, this channel started off as a fitness channel. Well, it evolved into me doing food challenges. I've been actually on YouTube, if you guys didn't know, since 2011. I started off just doing vlogs. I was super shy. I never, ever, ever imagined that my job would be traveling around 
doing food challenges and entertaining you guys through food. And I just, I really appreciate you guys. And I don't get to tell you guys that very often. And I just want to tell you guys whether, you know, you just come here for the food, you just come here for the cringe, you come here for the stupid jokes. It, it doesn't matter. I just really want to tell you guys from the bottom of my heart, I really appreciate you guys. I appreciate all of you who have supported me, who have, you know, shown me that it's totally possible to do your dream job. I don't I don't know how else to say it. I really appreciate it. I also appreciate all of you who came out to, su to support me on all these food tours that I did throughout the Northeast part of the United States. We also raised, as of the filming of this video, we're almost at $1,400 for St. Jude Research Hospital. So that's been another dream of mine is being able to raise money for charity. And I'm just happy to be in the position to do that. So I'm not gonna babble on anymore. No more sappy, Eric. Let's finish off the rest of this meal. Alrighty guys, well all our pastries are down. Next we have the famous rainbow cake right here, everybody. And I believe it's one of the more famous things at Carla's Bakery. Bottoms up. Boom. Had to get some peanut butter on there, you know, just in case we needed extra calories. All right guys, just like that. That has been <laughs> another video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It is currently 8.33, same day, August 19th. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know down in the comments below, like always. Subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. Hit that notification bell, people, right next to that subscribe button so you guys get notified whenever a future upload happens. And don't forget to follow me on my social media, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. You guys know the drill. Thanks again for watching the video, everybody.